In Field Genius, you can review your raw file at any point, as well as make any changes that are necessary. I'm just going to go into the main menu by clicking the Start button. And from the Home menu, you can go into the Data Manager and in the Raw File Viewer. And we're automatically taken to the to the end of your raw file. If we scroll up, we'll see the raw records for this job. What I'm going to do is just hit this Show Map button, and we'll see our job over to the side here. Now, any line that we click on, it'll uh, show us on the map um, what was done at that point. So for example, this uh, OC record is where we occupied this point. You can see it putting the total station there. When we shot the back site, you can see the shot to the back site. And similarly down here, the SS's, these are all of our side shots. And as we click on these, you'll see that particular shot that was taken. If I scroll down a ways, see here we've at some point moved the instrument. And so on. So what you may need to do if um, say one of these records is uh, incorrect. As an example here, if I can find it. These two points here, shot 61 and 62, I accidentally shot with the wrong description. So I want to change it from EDS to uh, manhole. So if I edit that record, it uh, opens up the editor. And I'm just going to take that out and change the description to manhole. Click the Save Changes. And you can see what it's done. It's told us that it's made an edit to this line. It shows us the uh, previous state with the old description. And then just below it is the new line that we've replaced it where the description has been corrected. I'll do the same with this one. Save that again. As well, anytime you make an edit to the raw file, a backup is made and stored in your in your uh, job folder, so you can easily get the uh, backup um, if you've done something wrong. So what we need to do now is reprocess this raw file to make these changes take effect. So. Um, shot 61 and 62 will have the new descriptions. So I just click the reprocess and then we'll close the raw file viewer. If we go into the coordinate editor now, I'll just find uh, let's go 60 to 64 So point 61, 62, 63, and 64 all have this manhole description now.